Great. Good afternoon, guys. So, in the previous session, we discussed a program to fetch the elements which are having the duplicates, right? Okay, that's fine. Now, let us see a new program, guys. That is finding the highest number of the list of elements in the, okay, all of you. Finding the highest number in the list of elements. It's very simple. It's very simple, guys. Okay. Uh, write, write a program to fetch the highest. To fetch the highest. To fetch the highest number in the list. In the list. Suppose let's take the list. Some elements are maybe 10 or 5 or 20, something 15 is there. Love you. Right? Uh, some 30. Let's take uh, uh, some 9, like this, 8, uh, something like this. There's no uh, specific order, right? Specific order. Now, out of all, what's the highest value, guys? Generally, in this case, uh, 30 is the highest, right? 30 is the highest value. So the expected output is. How much here? 30. Okay, so here different ways are there, guys. One by using the max function, the other one by using sort function, right? Like that, different ways are there by using inbuilt functions, by using inbuilt or built in functions. For example, simply we use a max of LST at max of LST. Let's try now. Let us try here max of LST, right? Uh, uh, on this one. So highest number, this is the one way. Or let's go for the next one. The same list I'm going to sort. I'm going to sort. If you see what is the output of after sorting, after sorting, what is the output here? Right? Sorry. Uh, this we cannot display, guys, here. The sort function will not return anything which will perform the operation. Now LS2 can try here the LST. Okay, so what came here? What came here? Ascending order came, right? Then take the minus one, index number minus one, minus one, 30 will come, right? So take the minus one, the third highest number will come, guys. Highest number. So like this, different ways to find the highest number with using the inbuilt functions. By using inbuilt, okay? So these are the two ways, guys, like this. But, the question is, without using inbuilt functions, how to do it? Without using inbuilt functions or built-in functions, how to do it? Means no max, or no, or no sort, anything. That's the question, guys, actually. So this is without, without uh, built-in functions. B-U-I-L-T, without uh, any built-in functions, guys. I love you. Right. So let us try now. Let us try. Uh, we'll take the some variable guys. Now we'll take some variable a equal to some zero. Anyone variable, okay? Uh, now for i in LST, i in LST. Now, what is the first time i value 10, right? I value is 10, guys. If the i value is more than the a value, Allah observe, if i value is more than the a value, then that i value assigned to a. Like, see the condition, if that i value greater than a, in that case, in that case, for a, I am assigning this i, assigning uh, this i. Like that, after all iterations, if I'm going to print, uh, print a, now in a, the highest value, 30 is there. The highest value 30 is there. Take any number. Suppose I'm going to take here some other number, maybe 40. But the highest value now, highest value is 40. And then we'll take some number somewhere 50, for example, right? Uh, 50. What's the highest number now? 50 is the highest number. Okay. Let us try. Let us try step by step, guys. Let us try now. So, first time, what is the I value? 
first time first time what is the i value first time i value is 10 right 10 now if uh, 10 greater than a what is a 0 10 greater than 0 true or false true or false yes it is the true if it is true then then for a for a i am giving the i value what they will right now but they will right now 10 na. that 10 na, i am giving to a right now a is the 10 na, but for a i am giving the 10 na. so what's a value now a value is 10 guys what's a value a value is 10 all of you okay for iteration over next iteration what is the i value i value is 5 all right next iteration what's a value 5 now what's a value 5 5 greater than a a will 10 right 5 greater than a currently what is a value currently a value 10 not the a 0 a is the old a 0 is the old value that old value update by which one latest value 10 now a will 10 right so 5 greater than 10 true or false true or false it is the false it is the false if it is the false then uh no uh that i value not assigned to a still a value what here same 10 only uh, next loop next i value 20 right i value 20 now i value 20 is the condition now so i value what here 20 20 greater than a what is a value 10 right a value 10 now so 20 greater than 10 now. true or false yes it is the true it is the true if it is true then uh, if it is true all of you if it is true then that i value assigned to a right now in the a 10 right 10 is there now the 10 up by what here i i am how much here 20 right now it will be 20 guys okay 20 uh, now the loop over next loop next loop what's value here right 15 coming up what's coming 15 right uh, 15 coming so i value 15 then the condition check it now true or false so 15 uh, greater than a a means what here right now 20 so 15 uh, greater than 20 true or false false so here it is the false it is the false if it's false uh, then no uh, right, no assignment guys right no assignment uh. okay uh, next loop next i value how much here 30 coming now 30 all of you here, guys. Okay, now 30 greater than 20, right? What's the value? 30. What's the value right now? 20, right? 20. So 30 greater than 20. True or false? True. It is the true. If it is the true, then uh, there what happens here? The 30. It's a value 30, right? The 30 assigned to A. Right now, in A, 20 is there. The 20 update by 30, right? 30. So this is 30 guys. 30. Uh, next one. Next iteration, what's I value? I value is the 8. I value is the 8. Now 8 greater than what's the A value? 30. So 8 greater than 30. True or false? It is the false. It is the it is the false. If it's false, uh, then no assignment, right? No assign the uh, value to I. Or Next, any value? No, all over, right? All over, right? Now, what is the latest A value, guys? Here, yeah, 30, that is the highest, right? See, the highest value is coming to 10, 20, that like that. Now, this is the highest value. That's why, after all iterations, uh, I'm taking which one? Uh, I'm taking here, 20 A, so that uh, the last uh, iteration value display, guys. That's all, right? Is the way uh, on uh, how to find uh, the highest value without uh, using any built in function, guys. Without using the uh, built in functions. Suppose how to find the second highest values are. Is the first right? This is the, is the first, first highest value. How to find the second highest values are. All of right. Second means what comes out put here? 20 comes right in this case. How to find the second highest number in the list, right? That's what we see in the next video, guys. Okay. Thank you so much, guys. Hello. Bye.